The woods behind our houses are have these dainty little cute yellow flowers in them right now that are called lesser celadine or also known as the fig buttercup and you can pick as many of these as you want for little bouquets in your home office because it is a horrible invasive um, and you can see how our trails look right now um, this plant has uh, its root system are these little tubers in the ground that very easily pick up and wash down waterways. So you can kind of see where the water flows in our woods by where these little flowers are. And it's quite striking. They're bright yellow flowers um, poking their little heads up right now. Uh, but they are an invasive as most things that look so overwhelming are. Um, and they suck our wet areas dry. And I've was talking with a neighbor and she said that we used to have a lot of peepers in these woods, those little frogs that go peep, 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 peep. Um, and my guess is that they're not in our woods anymore because these fig buttercups have sucked up all of the water they need for the tadpoles. So you can see this side of the trail's not as wet, but this side is. And immediately you see a lot of these lesser celadine or fig buttercup. And if we dig our hand in here, see if I can pull some of the root systems out so you can see these little nodules the way. So just that little thing there, if it broke off and washed downstream, so that's where the, the leaves were, if that broke off and washed downstream, it could start a whole new plant, just one of those little roots. So um, that is why these guys are so successful. In the wet, loose soil, some one of these breaks off, washes downstream, the water dries up, and then it goes gangbusters. So really dense, thick mats of this again. Lesser buttercup, or lesser celadine. <laughs> also known as the fig buttercup. So go out and take a look at it because it is quite impressive the way it fills up the woods and pick yourself a little bouquet. Um, and if you just see one clump in the woods, go ahead and dig that up and maybe you'll save your woods from looking quite this bad um, in the springtime. But these will go away and uh, they are out mostly in the springtime here. The greenery will stay here all, all season, but the actual flowers themselves are only out for a month or two now. So go out and find the big buttercup.